Hey everybody, what's going on? Once again, I said I was going to do daily vlogs. I'm going to try to stick to it. My name is Tilo. If you don't know that by now, then how did you end up on my channel? I don't know. But anyway, I just wanted to do a quick video to talk about the current state of hip hop. Uh, a lot of people want my opinion on music as a rapper, and they all ask me the same questions like how do I feel about such and such what do I think about this have I heard this and so I thought I would just put it all out there on a video the current state of hip-hop is very interesting um, we're, we're in a place where you have more than ever creative control where artists have more creative control than ever and that's incredible to see for musicians normally you had to be a very successful artist or an artist that A&Rs knew was going to be very successful that your creative vision is what made you who you were so then that's the only way you could get creative control in the past as far as branding visuals music and now with the internet, anybody can put any kind of music they want out there and get a buzz. And what I've found to be very interesting is that, you know, five, six years ago, there was so many different types of music out there. And there still is, but it's all kind of narrowed down, um, you know, to two big markets. You have the markets that, um, you know, everybody just throws a whole sound in there and just labels a mumble rap um, and there's a lot of good music in there that shouldn't be overlooked because of the stigma of mumble rap where they're stereotyped as mumble rappers there's a lot of good music in there but and then there's the artists that are super 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 like creative they want to do this this and this they have a point they really stand for what they talk about like they have they really stand tall for not only their art, but the things they believe in. So you have like, on one hand, you have what I'll say, artists that aren't really talking about anything. And on the other hand, you have artists that are talking about everything. And there used to be like a wide middle ground to get from here to here. But lyricism has really come back in a big way. And it's been incredible to watch. We always said lyrics were gonna come back and they did, it's just people don't, the people aren't really taking the time to recognize that. There's a lot of people who still bash mainstream hip hop, saying that there's no lyricism, there's no lyrics, but really the lyrics are back and they're mainstream and, they're, and it's out there for consumption. It's out there to watch, to stream, to download, to keep up with. You just have to be willing to look at it, you know, creatively yourself. You almost have to be a creative listener. You almost have to have your own imagination when you go in with these music, with these songs. Um, so really there's, there's like two core genres and they're at odds, like eternally. Like there's, again, I hate, I hate putting them all in one category, but you know what I'm talking about when I say the mumble rappers. You know, you have the mumble rappers over here and you have the rappers that are just talking about, you know, social, economic, world events, um, you know, even just mental health, drugs, you know, like awareness, addiction. You know, you have the artists that are really standing up and, and standing for their own principles and, and, and hip hop has really kind of narrowed down to these two groups and I think personally I think this might be the most entertaining time um, because on one hand we're getting great records that really like hype you up get you in a mood get you to move a certain way and records that really sound like they would go off in a club or party setting and you're also getting super lyrical um, creative standpoints that just, just unique, um, new, unique perceptions on life. Like, like, yo, you really got. I mean, if you're not paying attention to, you know, Joyner Lucas, if you're not paying attention to J Cole or Royce the Five Nine, you know, artists that are really putting together unique 
and there's so many more. I know I'm leaving so many out because it's it's almost impossible to keep up with. You know, if I left a name out, please comment below because I might not know about them. There's so many out there that are really doing some incredible work. And I just think, I, I wish they could all be recognized, but luckily we have the internet and we can go back to them and there's, there's no time limit, there's no rush. We can keep up with all these artists in our own time. And there's some incredible artists you should not overlook. And there's some older artists who are, who we knew 10, 20 years ago, who are redeveloping themselves, rebranding themselves, and really putting forth creativity like we've never seen from these artists. You know, you should really go back and give some of your favorite artists a search and see what they're doing today. You know, uh, like, like, man, there's, there's just so much going on in music right now, in hip hop especially, and I'm excited. So when you ask me about the current state of hip hop, we used to say hip hop is dead. That is not the case. Hip hop has been reborn. And there's just, there's so many incredible talents out there that are putting, that are, that are pushing the culture forward. We always say people who are pushing the culture and right now, currently, the current state of hip hop is there are people out there who are getting it every single day and pushing the culture forward. And I couldn't be more excited or proud to be a part of it. To be very honest with you, it's it's a little overwhelming at times because I feel like I can't be that creative. Like, yo, how did you think of that? You know, like, but at the same time, that's the competition. And I want to rise up and meet that competition. So check out all these artists. Uh, drop some names below that I didn't mention. And, uh, you know, exchange the culture with each other. Exchange songs with each other. Exchange links and let's grow this thing you know that's what hip-hop was always about growing and and an exchange of you know perceptions and ideas and music you know let's do it well that's today's vlog till next time peace